do the way these work, do they have to, you might not know this, but is, does it have to guess the whole thing successfully or can it, the way the computer works, does it have to say, let's say Bob was the first part of the, does it have to get the B, the O and the B and then the computer says positive, 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 like one, 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 or does it have to go the whole thing perfect? So if people keep things up to date, it does not do that. So for example, in old operating systems, NT4, Windows 2000, uh, you could crack passwords in chunks. And that's one of the main reasons that people who still have old Windows 2000, Windows 2003 servers and are basically dumbing down the security of the entire environment because everything has to come down to the lowest common denominator, that's actually still possible in some environments. Uh, and it also depends on what system you're using. But if people are, are updating, patching, staying with relatively current, in some cases that's possible, but it's not as easy as it used to be. And it is not a clear mathematical chunk of first you crack the first eight digits, then you crack the next four digits, then you crack the next uh, five. It, it's not really chopped up that way because as security's gotten better, you know how that's uh, chunked out has been scrambled. So that makes it a little bit easier. Now, not all systems work that way. So it does somewhat depend on the system you have. But we actually found that issue in this incident review as well. And it's because of uh, legacy systems that are being forced to stay in the environment. And, and quite literally, it makes everything operate as if it's still that old. Because mm. the authentication has to work off of that um, member of, of the domain? Uh, uh, not because it bounces off of it, but because you have, uh, think of it, if you have a pile of people who are biking together, that whole group, if they're going to stay together, will go as fast as the slowest peddler. Same thing is true. So that worst security server in your environment, everything has to be able to communicate all the way down to that level. And so it can't take advantage of the newer security changes. Okay. So for example, there's something called a hash, very popular for passing the hash attacks. That's how some credentials are stored. If you have older systems, you will have different types of hashes, some of which are very, very easy to crack. Okay. And it doesn't matter if your domain controller in Windows is updated. If you've got a bunch of member systems that are very, very old, everything has to come down and communicate to that level for everything to be able to operate correctly. Oh, that makes sense. Interesting. Now